Alright, today is October 20th and this is about 8 30 in the morning. Yeah, a little early. And I'm at Aloha Stadium and yeah I see a lot of people coming in. Activity here. And here to do my walking exercise. I got the souvenir. Yeah. Uh, Lynn's Market. Yeah, that's what it is. We'll give you your color. Yep. I almost graduated with my AA degree from high school. I was like two classes short because I started late. Oh, I was talking about the food. Yeah, they got so much. I mean, you know, a lot of the stuff I grew up with it. I remember you used to go to a little convenience store in the neighborhood and yeah. Buy this. Back then it was a lot cheaper. <laughs> yeah. We had pennies, nickels, dimes. Oh yeah, they even had stuff that we could buy for paint with pennies. I remember some candies they were yeah, pennies. Not anymore. <laughs> Can't buy anything with a penny anymore. Wow. Okay, there's some spots still available. Okay. <coughs> yeah, how inflation got up so high now. And maybe now the way at the rate that it's going, maybe pennies would be disappearing eventually off the market. So the hats here. Yeah. Then coffee outlet. Yeah. Kona coffee. Ah, a lot of clothing here. Very colorful. Alright. Alright, so many things here. Alright, and oh, all these open lots. Both sides. This side too. Two sisters, Jay. Oh, okay. They're setting up late. This side. Alright. Oh, still got vendors coming in. Wow, lots of different license plates. Ah, right, here it is, tourist items. Oh, Kona coffee. 100% Kona coffee, 8 ounce, $19. Yeah. Because a 7 ounce at Walmart is $22.98 though. So, as far as the Kona coffee goes, I guess 100% it is a deal here. Oh. 
Yeah, so they're undercutting the cheapest vendor in town, which is Walmart. So that's pretty good. knickknacks souvenirs wow these magnet ones are 125 each 10 for ten dollars that's cheap then we got all these open lots still yet okay Phone cases, five dollar. Okay. Lots of vendors are getting ready, still yet. Souvenirs. Yeah. All right. Well, at those rates, yeah, they're not core woods. All right. This. Yeah, there are lots of deals on ladies' clothing. Bag, $10 each. Okay. Ah, oh, souvenirs right here. Alright. Yeah, so this is still too early, I guess. Not too many people. Aloha shirt, all sizes, thirteen dollars. Okay. We got jewelry accessories. Ah, Blue Wave Hawaii car seats. Yeah. Ah, there we go. Coconut, peanut butter, jelly jams, and syrups. Yeah. And then a vendor that's going to be coming in soon. That. Alright. Maikai Hawaiian Clothing Company. Earth friendly towels. Bags. All sorts of bags. Slippers, seven dollars each. We got souvenirs on the right. Now fresh fruit. Yeah. And they already have customers. Ah, accessories, gift items. Yeah, surfboards, five dollar set. Alright, yeah. Alright. Oh, 
right here is a lot more surf license plates. And we got another vendor that's setting up in the process. Yeah. Okay. And we got more vendors due to come in. They got the tent set up. This side is the t shirts. Yeah. Soy candles. Then here's another vendor that's due to come in. Yeah. Just in process of setting up. Yeah. yeah. Lots of souvenirs. Hi. Yeah, lots of souvenirs. Yeah. Lots more souvenirs on the right. Yeah, you know, lately, oh yeah, there's cheap t-shirts. Yeah, lately, there's been quite a bit of uh, gun shootings in Hawaii. But, like for a while, every other day, there was a gun shooting. That's something that's really unheard of, you know, while I was growing up here. But now, lately, gee. And then, all sorts of people going off on road rage, you know. Yeah. I mean, I gotta tell you, <laughs> while driving, I just looked at a guy and they went off on me. <laughs> I go, wow, okay. He probably thought I gave him the, some weird eyes or something. So anyway, yeah, it's something I ignore and just kind of drive away. But yeah, lots of road rage going around. That's just recently I made a quick film, a short one, and that was very weird. It's like, oh my God. Where's all, where all the aloha went? People are not friendly or nice. Just, and then even, you know, some of the people, they're friendly. They tend to hold back because they're afraid somebody might go off on them. And that's, you know, road rage. Yeah. And I'm seeing more. I've had ladies, guys, it doesn't matter. It's just all sexuality. <laughs> Gender, just at times going off and wow I just got continue on you can't even look at a person you make an eye contact oh there they go road rage all right uh, that's one of the worst things you can get into involve road rage you don't know how far that person would go off on and hey, it can get very dangerous so I mean, that's a good chance, you know, possibility that that person probably is a nice person if you get to know him. But that person just, you know, you just came across a person, you look at them wrong or somehow something just turned them off and they go off on road rage. <laughs> you know, I got to tell you, when someone goes off on road rage, it's very, very nearly impossible to turn the situation down. And it also depends on how much you know road rage level they're at. Yeah. So that's something I've been you know coming across here and there. And so one thing is uh you know it's hard to just uh you know like uh, if you make an eye contact, you know, that split second of eye contact could set off that person's road rage so you know lately I'm trying not to make eye contact as much as possible with people you know unless they talk to me first or you know approach me or such but yeah it's scary nowadays to make eye contact with anyone you know you're passing by food oh look somewhere else <laughs> look away you know 
And then you look at the guy, you know, one wrong moment, and you can see that the person in road rage, you know, they're trying their best to make an eye contact with you. Come on, look at me, look at me, look at me. Oh, shit. <laughs> but that's how things are. And I don't know if there will ever be a solution to that, but, you know, I really gotta say, most people, I really think they're nice people, you know? I mean, they probably want to be greeted nicely, you know, have a nice greeting, have a nice chat or such, so forth. At least a lot of people, I would think, not everyone, you know? but they all, you know, like uh, whenever there are some, uh, they're prone to get into road rage here and there and wow, they really get out of control. And it's just non-stop once they in the road rage. It's just their anger fused and fused and fused. Yeah. Well. There are many people that I'm seeing nowadays. Oh, there we go. What are these? Oh, a lot of knickknacks. Yeah. Anything in mind? No. No. All right, we got some vegetables, fruits, yeah. Yeah, so, you know, I think best thing to do, maybe I next time I should wear sunglasses. You know, so that way, they won't see that I'm making an eye contact in any way. I mean, I do wear glass, Right, corrective lens and then it's got some tinting in it but it's not real dark where you can't see my eye so but still I mean by accidentally just now I just made an eye contact with the lady with the scary eyes I look away real quick <laughs> that's how it's gotten you know I mean, I remember in the old days, you know, when I was growing up, yeah, you make an eye contact, yeah, hey, yeah, you try to, you know, make a little more eye contact so you can greet and, you know, get to know each other. Hey, hi, how are you? How are you doing and such? You know? But now, no, best thing to do is look away, look somewhere else. You know, split, split, split second of eye contact and, oh, oh no, no, you know? Yeah. It is a strange world come to where it becomes more and more like we're in a battlefield and increasing into an enemy field. But anyway, that's the world we're living in. Oh, what did you see if anything? Yeah, oh, Halloween costumes. <laughs> well, okay. I don't plan on putting on any Halloween costume anymore, so, yeah, I guess uh, I'm just getting too old. Alright, yeah, I will put some candy. Of course, I will be sealed in wrap for each candy, so, and then put it in a pumpkin container, plastic one from Walmart. Yeah, I remember it used to be 99 cents, now it's $1.50, so I'll pick one up. And then put it right up my door and then put some candy, so each one wrapped sealed plastic. So any kids want, they can have it. Yep. I ain't even adults. Alright, ah, chips. Actually, hello. Oh, they all look so good. Yeah, look at that. Huh? Oh, sure. Which one? Spicy vinegar, barbecue chicken, bacon, shrimp. Oh, vinegar? Green, chocolate, spicy vinegar. Spicy vinegar. And it's vegetarian. Ah. Made out of green peas. No cholesterol, no trans fat. Oh, wow. Good. I'm diabetic. No meat. Try the mm. chicken. Try the chicken. The this chicken. one too? Yeah. They're all vegetarian. Oh. Special food. Okay. 
Barbecue chicken flavor. Barbecue chicken. Mm. Then up is that vegetable? <laughs> this is our number one sub. Huh? No meat. No. It's a bacon flavored potato chip. Yeah. Mm. Okay, I take one bacon, one uh this one, chicken, and one spicy vinegar. You got it. Huh? Oh. This is shrimp. Oh, okay. So okay. All right. Wow, they're good. No, I only wanted to. But, no, you got them all. Oh, thank you. Thank you, so <laughs> you guys are so good. All right. And the price is so good too. Yeah, they're really good. Thank you. Bye bye. Oh, so busy here. What do they have? Wow, okay. What, what's everybody crowding on? Oh, ladies, uh, conditioner, cream, and swords. Okay, so. All right, license plates. Okay, continue on. And yeah, so all right. Oh yeah, there's a fishing poles and accessories, and then here is a yeah, cap, hat, straw hat. So. Okay, rare coins. Good. All right. Okay, clothing, one dollar. They look new too. Wow, the ones on the table look so new and clean. And it's only one dollar each. Wow, good deal. Yeah, if I need shirt. Yeah. But I got enough at this side. <laughs> In fact, uh, more than enough, too many. <laughs> so I stopped buying any more clothes for a while. All right, and of course there's a watch repair. Yeah. Therapeutic massage, touch. And oh, here's the loose clothing here. Yeah. So, not oh, cheap. So, $15 each. Oh, for the bags on the bottom. All right. Oh, hey, they got the beach lake lounge chairs. All right. So, okay. Oh, game systems, game handles. Yeah.
Yeah, there's uh, fishing lures, yeah, and also weights, and yeah, a lot of variety of things. And here we go, vegetables and fruits. Alright, so this is my walk for the day and here we go. So thank you for watching.